Threat Prevention, SSL Inspection By the end of this training, you'll be able to enable SSL Inspection and enable Inspection by Asset Type. The SSL Traffic Inspection inspect traffic that is encrypted by the Secure Socket Layer Protocol. All hosts behind the gateway must install the Gateway CA Certificate. The blades that are supported are application control and URL filtering, IPS, antivirus, anti-bot, and threat emulation. However, by default, SSL traffic inspection is not being used, and we're using HTTPS categorization instead, which is filtering specified HTTPS URLs and applications without activating SSL traffic inspection based on the URL in the certificate file. You can easily switch from HTTPS categorization into SSL traffic inspection, but as you'll see in the demonstration, if you want to enable traffic inspection, there are a few things you need to do. First, you need to disable Smart Excel, and you also need to deploy the certificate within your clients. When enabling SSL inspection, you can select a bypass policy, meaning certain services or certain networks won't be inspected and the traffic will be bypassed. For example, you can bypass based on the network if it's a trusted network or an untrusted network. For example, one of your wireless networks. So you can say that any traffic coming from a trusted network would be bypassed or to bypass based on a category. So if the user will browse to a financial website, traffic won't be inspected and it will be bypassed. I've switched to my 1590 appliance. I'll go to access policy, SSL inspection. Now you can see that currently I'm using HTTPS categorization. If I would like to switch to SSL traffic inspection, I can see this warning. SSL inspection is not supported when Smart Excel services is on. So we'll need to press OK, go to Smart Excel, and disable it. Once you disable Smart Excel, you can go back to Policy and enable SSL traffic inspection. Now, I really like how informative this Quantum Spark is. I really like this comment here to deploy SSL inspection, download CA certificate, and install it on the hosts. You can click on download and here's the certificate which you can later go ahead and install it and if you'll click more info you can see that to enable outbound HTTPS traffic inspection follow these steps and you can see these specific steps showing you how to do that press close and let's talk about this setting here to inspect based on the asset meaning do I want to inspect desktops laptops or maybe select a specific assets. Like for example, IP phones and whatever it is that you like from this list. So you can select to enable SSL traffic inspection, which categories you want to bypass, which sources you want to bypass, and also if you want to bypass or inspect based on the asset that's being used. And if you want, more information is available in SK121214. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.